Hi, I'm David Dobiasic, the official voice of the best thriller books. I'm here to introduce the world premiere of The Five Angry Men. The boys will be discussing the series they're most embarrassed to admit they haven't read. You know, I'm not an angry man, but I might become one if they keep excluding me from these videos. So hey everyone, welcome to today's Five Angry Man session, where the five of us yahoos will discuss various topics. Uh, I promise you there'll be arguments, there will be ridicule, and there might even be some tears. Um, you just never know what you're going to get. So, gents, let's get started. And for this session, I'm putting you on the spot, and it's confession time. Uh, I know you all read a ton of books, but there's no way you can get to all of the great thrillers that are out there. So, I want to let the people out there know, what thriller author or series are you embarrassed to admit that you haven't read yet. So let's see, who am I going to put on the spot first? Uh, Todd, you're yeah. not me. What's up, man? Let me let me go because I I will fully admit this is terrible. Uh, I read my first CJ Box uh, Picket book today, which is that's embarrassing. I don't know how to say it. It's truly embarrassing for someone who Wait, used to live who, in the Rockies. Who's CJ Box? Who, who is this C, CJ Box guy? Uh, so yeah, I, I, I honestly, one of those things where I have no idea how that happened. Like that's his stuff's right up my alley. And I, I just failed guys. I failed you. You're the I don't worst. know what happened. I'm the, You're worst. the worst. Which one yeah. did you read? Um, oh my God. I don't even know his newest one. <laughs> it's on my gotta, Kindle. The wow. arc. I can't even remember. Oh, that's that bad. I'm that bad. It was you got to really start good, at the beginning. I do. I need to start over. Uh, I, I read it in a single day though. I enjoyed it that much, but, um, Dark Sky. Yeah, but you can't remember the name. Dark Sky. It's Dark Sky. <laughs> how, do you, so how do you miss a series that's like 20 some books long? Right? I, <laughs> seriously. Seriously. They've been out since almost the 90s. Uh, yeah. I don't know. I, I feel like I just kind of got into too many military and espionage thrillers and not enough, like, kind of, you know, more Mountain West um, oriented thrillers. I don't he's know. He's a good I, writer, I, I though, isn't he? It's fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. He sets like, a I, scene that on the page that you're, he's one of the most descriptive mm -hmm. writers out there that, you know, I mean, yeah. Cosby, the same thing with um, Blacktop Wasteland. You just feel like you're there, you know? Yep. Absolutely. So, so. so you're going to rectify this, Todd, and go back and read the whole series? Uh, I believe January will be heavily CJ Box uh, filled for me. I'm just going to, yeah, just plow through it. I can't believe we've got two people in here that neither of them have read it. Sorry, guys. That's I crazy. You charged. You guys are but psychotic. seriously, Blacktop Wasteland, I, you guys were talking all about that, and I haven't even picked that up yet. I've been uh, dude! Things and, uh, I've, I've finished dude, that yesterday. Right here. I'm rereading <laughs> it I go, go. already. Yeah. Uh, it's there's good. so many it's in the 2B red pile. I mean, how many of you guys have bought books and put them in your 2B red pile, and three years later, they're still sitting in your 2B red pile? Well, not that long, but like we were no. talking yeah. earlier. <laughs> no, about, I don't do that. What? About Meg Gardner. Well, what? if Derek waits three years, he's not going to be able to read. So I just. <laughs> <laughs> That's All true. right, youngster. Uh, yeah. Wow. I've got a couple uh, on my TBR pile that I went and got them signed at a book event, and I haven't read. Uh, Dark Corner of the bad, Night man. by Meg Gardner. And then that's, I'm hitting that one next. I mean, it's, I've read the first two, and I just haven't read that one yet. Yeah, you guys all say it's great. I struggle moving stuff around in my to be read. Six months is about as far out as I have ever gotten. If if I if it takes me more than six months to read a book, I've something's gone terribly wrong. Maybe Let's flip it back on you, Steve. What what about yeah. you? Uh, oh, yeah, me. This this one hurts a little bit. So, um, I'm a big Mark Cameron fan, right? I've read his Jack yes. Ryan books, uh, you know Tom Clancy ones. I've read. Um, the Always Cutter series, uh, which is two books in, which I really, really like, set up in. I read I read Open Carry two nights ago. Yeah, good. yeah, up in Alaska. It's really cool. But I have not read a single one of the Jericho Quinn books. And I just, I cannot believe I haven't done that. I feel like the biggest a-hole on the planet because Mark Cameron's a great writer. I'm reading mm -hmm. his other stuff and he's a cool dude. They're great. They're yeah. great. So yeah, I got to gotta fix that. I got to fix that. Chris just likes him because he's in the book. I know. It's like anybody who listens wife, to Chris, that's, though. That's not true. That's not true. I might have consulted. <laughs> anybody who takes stuff from Chris. Yeah, it's a little questionable for sure. But yeah. uh, 
Yeah, Mark's a cool but, dude. I got to I got to get into those uh Jericho Quinn books. I've heard nothing but good things. It just you know, I just skipped over them for some reason. I don't know why. They're great. Motorcycles, uh, a Latina girlfriend. Um there's just there's so much to him. He's a unstoppable force that's great. So I mean, I Are you getting to well, a midlife say, crisis, Chris? No, Second you have a motorcycle. You know, girlfriend, <laughs> motorcycle. <laughs> right to it. My wife would not appreciate that, guys. Yeah, it's a good thing like no one's going to see this. So you're going to yeah, do it. exactly. <laughs> be all, all just right. be all four of us, dude. What about you, man? Uh, so I apparently I have two, uh, because Mark Cameron, I I have not read anything of his yet. Oh, get on. out of here! <laughs> I'm dead serious. Uh, uh, Alaska Santa, come on. These I think these two will will both hammer me. I've read a lot of them, but I also have not read any. Andrews and Wilson yet. <sighs> yeah, I know. We've got, a rough. We've got the out. six degrees of separation. Chris and, turned me on to him. I turned Todd on to him. Yep. Todd, you got to go up. I do. Yeah. I do. I told him I was going to send him my entire library of them. I'll mail them to him. Um, they're amazing. Like, I, I don't know. Like, again, I, I have a recent convert, and they are seriously some of the best writing I, in books I've, I've read. I read that whole series. Whole series. I read the whole series in a week, plus scars. So six six books and scars in under a week. I, I'd was, like to believe you, but you've never read C.J. Box before, so I'm Shot, having a little it. problem with it. <laughs> <laughs> different type of book. Different type of book. I don't know, it's but not, awesome. Credibility is kind of shot there. Man. I know. But seriously, I, I, got, I will I say I do agree with you, Andrew Wilson. Yeah. They, they kill it. Every book is fantastic. Um, Actually, I, know a bunch I believe of you, John Dempsey kills it. I mean, a lot. True. Yeah. <laughs> a lot. He kills a lot. <laughs> There's a lot of dead bodies, which uh, you know yeah. we all appreciate, I'm sure. Hey, I've only read one awards books. I mean, that's it. I haven't read. Oh, wow. Yeah. I know. I just. No. Just what? Yeah. What? Most recent one. Test and Strike. Oh, oh you yeah. guys are gonna hate me. Uh, well, I mean, S we Stu, do. I've. I've... <laughs> Stu, I'm <laughs> disappointed in you, he but does, but he I. Does the audio books. <laughs> I know that. <laughs> Todd and Steve are really going to hate me for this. Um, oh, no. Don't Daniel, say it. Daniel it. Silva. If I could reach uh, through this phone, you're dead to me. You. Seriously. Like, I don't know. I, I literally don't know how it's possible. Like, he well, is like I have the grand on my shelf. I have three of them on my shelf right now. Um, <laughs> but but I don't know about you guys. Like, when you find a new <laughs> series, do you, do you start at the beginning and catch back up? Because when i spoke to mr cameron and and started you know talking to him about some things he sent me a few books and i read the whole jericho quinn series it took me a couple of weeks but i mean i started at the beginning and i was like i can't stop until i've caught up it's that kind oh, of thing i like how you slide that you sound like todd yeah when i was talking <laughs> to mark greeny and chris howdy uh, he's telling me all this stuff that little humble no. right there huh yeah no oh. Mark that no, Mark doesn't talk to me. No, he's smarter than that. No, oh, you gotta, you gotta. I think with with Daniel Silva, read start at the beginning because there's a whole yeah, evolution yeah. of his character. Yeah. Well, yeah. Todd beat me so over the head good. with that. I ordered the uh, was it the order the, the order I ordered that one, and they were like, yeah, well, you should probably yeah. Order that. You're, yeah, yeah, yeah. You gotta start. So, yeah, don't start there. Start at the beginning. Yeah, Todd's gotta take his own advice on that too and start CJ Box from the beginning. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm starting over. One yeah. of the brilliant things about that series is you see like his family and his kids grow up, you know, in real time from book to book. Yeah, and yeah. It adds such a great dimension to him, and if you just start in the middle or the end, you totally miss out on that. I think uh, you you had said that, and like I as I was reading, uh, Sheridan is featured in this one a little bit, and I was just kind of thinking like, oh, I would like to know how she got to where she is in her life. So yeah, definitely definitely gonna do that i'm going back and but i i do that like miller i i will if i catch a book mid-series i'm ocd and i will go back and and start at the beginning and read them all my wife doesn't like that because then there's hundreds of dollars of book purchases <laughs> but yeah what are you gonna do she's a doctor come on that's true <laughs> well, uh, her, her 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 complaint is where do i store these books i'm having i'm having storage issues with her working from home now no, no, alert. She's working and Todd's sitting out on his back porch <laughs> having a drink. Exactly. <laughs> Dear Talking about Cup. books. Living the Dear dream Anka. over there. Exactly. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. In Florida, Florida, no less. In Florida, nice exactly. and sunny. But he, but he did have to do laundry and dishes before he came outside. <laughs> uh, that's true. I actually did do both of those. Yes, that's, that's true. Uh, My, know, know your role, Todd. Know your role. Hey, hey. I don't, I'm on vacation. I, I had three weeks of vacation, so 
I was slamming all the books I missed this year in. Awesome. All right, guys, yeah. let's wrap this one up. Is there anything else you want to confess before we, uh, we move on? Well, was, was Ward's Derek's? Was that his? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Which okay. I'm going to start, right. I'm going to go back and start reading the whole assassin series. So that's a good call. Yes. Yeah. I Slash do have one other. Has anybody ever read John Connolly? Yeah. yeah. Okay. I've not. I've not. I, I haven't either. Todd, I, you and I yeah. are banished to the East Coast. So, yeah. um, we're, we're not allowed out west. I don't know how you guys read between these two. Yeah. Have you yeah. read Michael Connolly? Dude, you haven't read Andrews and Wilson. Yeah. Uh, the number one point. military thriller on Amazon right now. Right and meow. That... Uh, yeah. Do you even read, bro? Yeah. <laughs> I'm still stuck hey, on the hey, silver. That's like, another topic for another day. Right. Y'all yeah. know, I, I can't I, read. I, so we'll, we'll get to that. In another that's one. true. But, uh, hey, guys, thanks for the chat. Um, All right. got, we just added a bunch of books to the TBR pile, which is awesome. Um, you know, we'll, uh, you know, we'll catch back up with you guys later once you've gotten through those and we'll see what you thought, but, uh, all right. thanks for admitting, uh, how much you all suck <laughs> and, uh, we'll talk again soon. All right. Peace. Thanks for having us. Good to see you guys. Yeah.